Good morning. Jesus is Lord. Thank God the word works. So we're looking at, does God want you, his child, to be interested in, to desire, to ask him for material things uh, like houses, cars, diamonds, uh, PWCs, those are watercraft, you know, boats, motorcycles, airplanes. Does God want you to have these things? Well, we're going to look at what the Word says. And remember yesterday I told you that the prevailing thought in religion is that you, from the, from the verse, seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all of these things shall be added unto you. So the prevailing thought is you work to further the kingdom, and then God will just add to you the things he wants you to have. Well, that doesn't line up with the rest of the word. So we're going to look at what does God say about things. I encourage you to write these scriptures down, meditate on them until you get these scriptures in your heart. Because faith comes only one way, and that's by hearing the word of God. And you cannot have faith for something that is not in the word because the word has the faith in it. Faith begins where the will of God is known. Once you know that what God's will is, then you can believe him for it. So let me just give you these scriptures. Matthew chapter 6, verse 8. Your father knoweth what things you have need of before you ask him. But, yes, he does. But notice, you still have to ask him for the things that you desire. See, that's how God is no respecter of persons. Okay, Matthew 6, 32. For after all these things do the Gentiles seek, but your heavenly Father knoweth that you have need of all these things. But seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. And I have to pick up on this I left off yesterday, that he's not talking about furthering the kingdom. He's talking about, it would be like if uh, you as an employee went to your employer and said, I need um, say I need a new uh, I need some more paper or I need some more pencils and he says well it's in the storehouse it's in the supply house just go get it that's what God's saying everything is in the kingdom It's the father's good pleasure he has given you the kingdom he's saying all of these things are in the kingdom come to me first Come to my kingdom first, and I will supply you with all of these things. That's what he's saying. So he's not talking about furthering the kingdom. He's talking about you receiving out of the kingdom for yourself. Say myself. Okay. Then Matthew 7, 7, ask, and it shall be given unto you. Then Matthew 7, 11 says, But if you being evil know how to give good gifts unto your children, how much more will your heavenly Father, notice this, give good things, things, yes, earthly things, things that, uh, material things, to them that do what? Ask Him. So yes, He knows what you have need of, and yes, he does desire for you to have these things. He just wants you to ask him for them. Have to pick up on this tomorrow. Remember all day, Jesus is your Lord. He wants to bless you with things. And thank God, the word works.